Hey guys, it is me again, as you can uh, probably tell. At least I hope you can. Uh, let's see, today is Thursday. March 31st, actually. Last day of the month. Makes it day 90 on our project serving more. Yep, I remember now that it's the last day of the month because I gave mom money to go to the grocery store tomorrow and she said, I may wait the Saturday. And I said, Why are you going to wait the Saturday? We're out of food. She said, Well, tomorrow's the first of the month and all the checks will be out. Where the third is on a Sunday. If the third comes on a Sunday, then they send all the checks on the first. So anyway, she said it'll be crazy tomorrow. So uh, <laughs> I know most of you guys probably don't have to deal with that where you live, but around here, uh, you can definitely tell when all the check drawers get the get the checks because it's it's crazy. Uh, at least at like the grocery stores and Walmart and the bank and that kind of stuff. We're we're usually not real busy on the first. Uh, but anyway, guys. Uh, I'm glad you're here tonight. I'm going to try to make this vid short because Dad has already went to bed on me. He went to bed earlier tonight than he normally does. So, uh, you know, I just don't want to rattle on in here for 12 or 15 minutes with him in the room next to me, straight through the wall from me. So, um, yeah, I'm going to try to make this shorter, guys. I did not get to do comments tonight, guys. I'm, I promise you tomorrow I will. I'll do comments. I know I may have a couple emails and stuff too, and some other stuff, you know, to do with YouTube, so, uh, I'll get to them tomorrow evening. As far as I know, I don't have anything planned. I had some things kind of catch me this evening, some, uh, family members actually, um, come and visited that, you know, I didn't know about, and this and that, and just some other stuff came up. So anyway, guys, uh, I hope you'll forgive me for that, and I know that you will. Well, let's get right into it tonight, guys. Like I said, I, I'm going to make this video short because I don't want to wake dad up or or uh actually he's probably still awake he's he's just been in the bed a few minutes but i don't want to keep him up so anyway let's continue tonight guys luke chapter 4 verse 34 if you guys remember this where we stopped yesterday just saying let us alone what have thou excuse me what have we to do with thee now this is when jesus ran into the demon possessed man thou jesus of nazareth art thou come to destroy us i know who the I know thee who thou art, the Holy One of God. And Jesus rebuked him and saying, Hold thy peace and come out of him. And when the devil had thrown him in the midst, he came out of John and heard him not. What did I just say? Come out of John? Come out of him. He came out of him and heard him not. Well, where I got that from? And they were all amazed and spake among themselves, saying, What a word is this? For the authority for with authority and power he commanded the unclean spirits, and they come out. And the fame of him went out into every place of the country round about. And he rose out of the synagogue and entered into Simon's house. And Simon's wife, wife's mother was taken with a great fever, and they besought him for her. And he stood over her and rebuked the fever, and it left her. And immediately she arose and ministered unto them. Now when the sun was setting... All they that had any sick with diverse diseases brought them unto him, and he laid his hands on every one of them, and he healed them. And devils also came out of many, crying out and saying, Thou art Christ, the Son of God. And he rebuking them, suffered them not to speak, for they knew that he was Christ. And when it was day, he departed and went into a desert place, and the people sought him, and came unto him, and stayed him that he should not depart from them. So they were begging him. And he said unto them, I must preach the kingdom of God to other cities also, for therefore I am sent. And he preached in the synagogues of Galilee, it says. That finishes up chapter 4. So uh, tomorrow we'll be in chapter 5. Unless the Lord puts it on me to go somewhere else, you never know. you know. Uh, anyway, guys, like I said, I'm glad you all were here tonight. I'm sorry for making this short. Some of you guys probably like these shorter vids, so it may be right up your alley. But uh, anyway, guys, just keep uh, keep praying for me. Uh, keep praying that our weather gets better here soon. I tell you, uh, looking for me, Marbles made a video today asking everybody if uh, the weather got them in a funk like it does him. You know, just you know, makes you just feel bad, not want to do nothing. 
And uh, yes, it does me. I mean, the weather, I, I actually hate to admit it, how bad that the weather affects my attitude. It affects my mood. Uh, you know, when the weather's good and it's pretty and it's warm, I'm just, I'm so much, you know, I'm just, I don't let things bother me as much. I do more. I guess a lot, a lot of us are like that. Maybe all of us, but just pray for us, guys. I think the weather's supposed to start turning around in the next few days. So uh, pray for my church. Pray for my family. Pray for my business. We did. We had a real good day today. Uh, a bunch of people paid us for a bunch of stuff, and you know those tires I was telling you about. I think we got paid for all those. And uh, actually, we brought in more money today than we have the rest of the week put together. So. Uh, so just keep praying for us, guys. And uh, good Lord willing, I'll be back here tomorrow night. So until I see you guys again, good night. God bless.